Hey folks, how you doing? Alex with Bay Cities Construction here. Just pulled the permit for uh, one of our jobs in Santa Monica, and uh, I'm going over to one of the other, um, another building in Santa Monica for, um, this is a lead that came in on our website for a soft story retrofit. So I'm gonna go do a site visit. gotten quite a bit of, of a response from our our efforts online with our uh, soft store retrofit promotion it's a great deal if you guys haven't heard of it we're doing um, 12,497 for full architectural and engineering I'm sorry I'm driving in my car I want to make sure I don't uh, whack somebody out here so I'm doing a uh, full architectural engineering city representation the whole complete package and a quote that'll include a hard quote for construction for 12 497 also want to mention that there's a big big benefit to us doing the plans for you you see uh, a lot of the engineers that are doing this now are starting to get into this business it's uh, a relatively new law it's the demand for the the retrofit work to get started is just starting right because everybody's put it off the law the law came into effect a couple years ago it started with um, the first people on the list are any soft story buildings that are over three units and have three stories or two stories of living space above the garage area the only problem is that you can't really quote it very well or you can't quote the the project accurately without having the actual plans so here's where you're 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 stuck uh, you know what came first the chicken or the egg if you don't have plans you can't come up with a with a quote a real one depending on how you design the plans it affects the cost some of the engineers are calling for moment frames and uh, you guys can check on our website basicconstruction.com under uh, soft story retrofit basically a moment frame is the is a, is a u-shaped frame that goes over the opening of where the parking garage is and if you use a moment frame that is welded instead of prefabricated like by Simpson you can increase the cost by quite a bit sometimes 10 or 15 percent could be even as high as 20 percent depending on how many moment frames you need, you need right the bottom line is what I'm telling you is that if you don't have input from a contractor to the engineer the engineer could come up with a solution that will de definitely be structurally sound but it'll cost you a lot more money and it's not necessary it's not necessary I've seen quite a bit of plans that came through that the homeowners went directly with the engineer and uh, forget it I mean it, it's calls for welding everywhere it calls for a bunch of stuff that is, is a bit old-school it's it's basically welding moment frames is a, a technique used in high-rise buildings right where the, the entire buildings made out of out of steel I-beams so you're, you're adapting that where where you, you make some big gains is by buying the prefabricated beams made by like Simpson that it's basically uh, plug and play when you have stuff welded it has to be inspected uh, the welds have to be certified especially um, if the building is two stories so there, there's issues there's issues with welding um, that add to labor costs and there's also a shortage of labor in the welding world um, you have to have the tenants move out uh, more times than not because the welding fumes are toxic so it's then you you got attached the new um, metal frame to your existing uh, wood building, and uh, you know that thing is is an issue because a lot of those I beams there's sections that you can't um, screw into. So you know it's it's a big puzzle for for your contractor to figure out when you're using welding because there's sections of those I-beams that you can't mess with. Anyway, I'm, I'm pulling up here to, to the house. I'm looking forward to sharing with you. Let's see what uh, this project looks like. And um, I'll give you my thoughts as I walk the job. Pretty big size building. It's definitely gonna be a couple of moment frames. It could be two moment frames, two in the back and two in the front, which would probably bring the cost of this thing up above 100,000. It's very possible. Let me give you a little shot of the front. Just, uh, just came back in, did a little walk around over here on this place in, in uh, Santa Monica. It's pretty big, right? I mean, it's um, well over 30 
be six feet. Not too more than that. It's definitely gonna take a moment frame, probably to the width of two parking spaces. It could be, uh, the retrofit could be from here all the way to that post there uh, behind the forerunner. That would be the repair. Would be basically a moment frame in the front, a moment frame in the back, and, uh, and a grade beam, which is a solid beam from post to post that's subterranean. And it'll be like two feet deep, two feet wide. Big boy, it's be big, big. Luckily, there's not a lot of plumbing in the way here. There is a post that looks like it's structurally a little weak, um, but it could have been something that got popped. This is kind of a, an interesting project. It's a good sized project, a big building. It looks like it's probably 10 units, maybe 12 units. Interesting project. Um, I'll, uh, if we get this project, if we're awarded this project, I'd, I'd love to uh, fill you in and show you what the plans look like. Uh, we pulled the plans for our other project in Santa Monica. That's why I'm here. I'm gonna go down to Sautel, which is in West LA, not too far from here. It's about four or five um, miles from here. Since I'm already down here, I came to just do a job walk on both of these projects so that I could give the property owner or manager uh, some usable feedback. So let's go check out the next one. Hey everybody, so I'm over here on Sautel checking out uh, another soft story building that we're gonna be pricing out. And this is in LA. So this is like the epitome, right, of, of a soft story. You see how the wall here is missing right underneath that car? There's no wall there. So that makes the structure weak. This wall over here has got, it's pretty interesting. It's got one side of the wall, it's level with uh, grade. And on the other side, it's subterranean. So this is probably, this can probably be fixed with one moment frame. One moment frame may be able to fix this. And then under here, this would be basically cut, the concrete would be cut out, and you'd have what's called a, a grade, a grade beam right here, where you have reinforcement along this entire area, and it covers, it attaches to the moment frame posts. Although, in all honesty, I think the moment frame would probably go from there to here. It's gonna be a little tricky because you don't have a lot of height so it's gonna be it's gonna be tricky to stick this in here. This is this because it's a sloped driveway. It's not it's not an easy deal to fix. It's gonna take a little creativity to be able to keep the clearances. So anyway, that's a, that's an update on my field trip over here in West LA. Well, I'll keep you updated. For those of you that need uh, soft story retrofit work, we got a special going on right now. Twelve thousand five hundred. 12,497, 12,500 bucks pretty much. That'll get you full architectural engineering. It'll get you city representation. It'll also get you a detailed quote for the repair work. It's all guaranteed. Give our offices a call, 888-881-7355. My name's Alex with Bay Cities Construction. Reminding you, you don't need a contractor. You need a team of pros.